Hey guys, Aubrey here. Today I'm doing the Eureka Math Grade 4 Module 1 Lesson 17 homework. So let's get started. Um, draw a tape diagram to represent each problem. Use numbers to solve and write your answer as a statement. Alright, so number one, Gavin has 1,094 toy blocks. Avery, on Avery only has 816 toy building blocks. Oh yeah. How many more building blocks does Gavin have? So let's make a tape diagram. G for Gavin. Alright, so Gavin, he has 1,094. And then Avery only has 816. So our job is to figure out how much more does Gavin have in Avery. So what we can do is to subtract 1,094 minus 816. 4 borrow 10. 14 minus 6 is 8. 8 minus 1 is 7. And 0 minus 8 borrow 10 is 2. So he has 278 more building blocks. And let's check our answer. So we can add 816. So that'd be 14, 9, and 10. So yeah. So that means Gavin, Gavin has 200, was it 278 more building blocks. So yeah. And um, number two, we have container B holds 2,391 liters of water. Together, container A and container B hold 11,875 liters of water. How many more water, uh, how many more liters of water does container A hold than container B? So let's see, B, we know it held 2,391 liters. Altogether, container B and A hold 11,875. So what we're trying to figure out is how many more liters container A holds. So we want to figure out how many container A holds, first of all, and how many more it holds than container B. So what we can do to find that out is to subtract. So 11,000. Minus 2,391. So let's see. 5 minus 1 is 4. 7 minus 9, borrow 10. 17 minus 9 is 8. 7 minus 3 is 4. 1 minus 2, borrow 10. All minus 2 is 9. So that's how much container A holds. And now it says how many more liters of water does it hold? Well, let's do 9,481. Minus 2,391. 4 minus 1 is 3. Minus 9 becomes 18 minus 9, which is 9. That's 0, and that's 7. So, 7,093. So, that means container A holds 7,093 more leaders so yeah all right next page a piece of yellow yarn was 230 inches long after 90 inches had been cut from it a piece the piece of yellow yarn was twice as long as a piece of blue yarn at first how much longer was the yellow yarn than the blue yarn all right so let's see So it was 230 inches long, the yellow yarn. But after cutting nine, 90 inches, you know, we don't have to just do it. It was 230. But after cutting 90 inches, as much as 90, so I cut that much. The yellow yarn was twice as long as the blue yarn. So in the blue yarn, so in the blue yarn, should be like that much. 
So we want to figure out how much longer is the yellow yarn than the blue yarn. So first we have to find out how long is the yellow yarn now. So 230 minus 90 be 0, 4, 1. So that would be 140. So right now the yellow yarn is 140 inches long. But then it says um, now what well, after it was cut, it's twice as long as the blue yarn. So which means 140 divided by 2 would be 70. So that means the blue yarn is 70 inches long. So now it says um, how much longer was the yellow yarn than the blue yarn. But at first, so at first the yellow yarn was 230 inches long. And then the blue yarn was always 70 inches. So then 0 minus 0 is 0. 3 minus 7, borrow 10, that would be 6 and 1. So that means that it was 160 inches longer. So at first, the yellow yarn was 160 inches longer. So yeah. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video helps. And please don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps out my channel. See you guys next time. Bye.